turkey that will break down. Break it down. Okay. Um, and if you want to do this along with me, I know some of you have already done this. So break pieces it. of rock like this if, are good if or... If it's rock, if it's rock, just take it out. Just take it out. That's pretty cool. So screening is a good idea. Yeah. And uh, you'll see some of it is just chunks of, of uh, material. Yeah, this and, has uh, a lot of shale in it, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see see uh, signs of, of that. Uh, and then I would recommend uh, holding it, kind of consolidating it. I'm going to put a little bit of water. So I like using saliva myself, but you probably don't want me to spit in your hand. Yeah. <laughs> I'd rather not. It's Thank you. I don't experience. know you that well. And I can see the now, different... Now, can you put saliva in there yourself? Or you want no, I don't have that you much. Have Sorry. That much. You want, want a glass of water? Old people dry out, I think. Okay. <laughs> kind, of, kind of get that all mixed in there. I gave you a little bit more than I needed. But look what's already uh, happened. Can you see what's happening? It's delicious. Yeah. Can you see how it's... Now, now just keep squeezing those. Now, some of you want a little bit of moisture? More. Well, or so you can give her, might, yeah, yeah, give, you want to yeah. dry out a little? Yeah, give Kathy a little bit of that. So the first thing I would recommend you do with your, your, your soil is uh, take a sample like Kathy's got, you know, send about four ounces to your, uh, your state soil agency, uh, what is it called, uh, ag, your state ag, agriculture department. They'll do a test for you about mm -hmm. 20 bucks. 15, 20 bucks. They'll tell you what you got. But this is going to give you um, a rough idea of what I'm going to show you. This is nice. It is. Yeah. This is why I had so much fun when it rained okay. and I got to play in it. So now what you're going to do is you're going to put your other hand on top of this hand, like kind of flat like that, and you're going to make a circular motion um, as if to uh, make a sphere out of it. You see how that came into it? Now let's okay. see what you. Good job, Hi. Karen. Welcome. Hi. Yes. Um, this is uh, some of Kathy's soil that she's brought. Now, if you can make a sphere, there's a lot of information on her hands. You can see how she's got uh -huh. uh, clay. That's clay here, right. filling filling up. This is actually a good thing to do before you read palms, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It really shows the lines up good. Um, Anyway, what I was going to say is if you can create a sphere, then the, the, bet, the bet will be that there's at least 30% clay. At in least. This, at least. Okay? So now we're going to do one more thing. Well, several more things. Now put your hand back on top and just go back and forth now. Back and forth. Back and forth. Now this, and is, this is almost like pure clay. Now it do that a like little it. slowly. Do that a little slowly and let, let little... I'm, I'm envious now because I this is the part I want to do. Okay, I'm gonna. Can you just go and s spit on a little bit? Yeah. Okay. And roll it back in a ball. How about phlegm? Is phlegm okay? Phlegm's, yeah. Yeah, phlegm's better. Phlegm's actually better. It's got some binding action. Now Thank you get. Thank you, God. I finally know what to do with it. Okay. Now, yeah. Okay, okay. Now that's good. So, actually, <laughs> actually, we could use a little. This is this isn't. Uh, a little more water. So let's what, consolidate. What I'm going to give you. A, well, it's, would Peter. Uh, yeah, uh -huh. Peter. Peter. So and his is still I'm a little gonna, shiny. Gonna, Mine has lost its shine. You can kind of direct shine. some of the water there, and I you think can it's take a fifty. So sphere it, roll it back, kind of mush it all together, get that water back in there. Yeah. Hey, hey good <laughs> job. Good job. You're very consistent. Yeah, consistently slow and The late. last one. <laughs> I thought I was going to be the last one, but you beat me. No, oh, I, I, had, I had permission for a, for right. a lion. <laughs> yeah. Doctor's orders. Very important. But I forgot to take two aspirins and call me in the morning. <laughs> okay, so now, if you can make a 
we call this the ribbon test. You can make a ribbon, yeah? Then the bet is there's at least... You do your car! <laughs> okay. Well, we'll take that to the the recycle in town. Oh, yeah, I was in recycle in the town. And, and they don't take it. Because I, I went first uh, to Valigur Old. Yeah. And I was thinking they take metal in the town, so I didn't even ask them. And yeah. They take the, plas the plastic, but uh -huh. not to the metal. And see, uh, see on Monday if you can get a phone number for the Valley View place. Yeah. And ask them if they take the metal. Oh, she, in the town she said me they, they do. Oh, they do? Yeah. Okay. Habitat. So, for your information, we'll keep our uh, recycled metal over where the metal roof is now. The metal roofing that was left. We'll keep it there, and next trip we make, you can take it then. Good idea. Yeah. Okay. Enjoy. Thank you, All right, Yurka. See ya. Bye. Um, okay. So now that's in the time that we had that conversation with Yurka. This, what, what did this do? Start drying out. Started dr drinking up that free moisture. Whoa, so, so now it's breaking. So, so you want to rehydrate. Peter's been staying on top of hydrating. Lots of spitting. Yeah. <laughs> so what? <laughs> Sorry, I don't have much. Here, I'll help you out. You're down a quart. Um, so, you know that yeah, famous sure. Italian mouse? Put, tip, put one hand over the top and just leave the Topo's tail sticking up. And go back and yeah, go back and forth. See ya, Topo. Hello, Topo. <laughs> <laughs> nice, Come, uh, nice tail. Nice tail. Oh. oh. I saw that coming. <laughs> <laughs> so what happens with this test, what happens with this test is now, now you want to see, can you bend Topo's tail 90 degrees? So mm -hmm. I didn't finish what I was saying. Okay, so you made a ribbon, the bet will be you've got 40% clay content. If it bends 90 degrees, the bet will be you probably have 50% clay content. If this can go even further without cracking and make a circle, that bet will be you're in a 60 to 70% clay content. Mm -hmm. Now, that is actually possible that that is there, but just a little bit, let that hydrate. You know, because you could, some of these pebbles here uh, are just simply, what? Dry. Chunks of clay. Chunks of clay. Okay. That kind of thing. Uh, another way to be a little bit more um, thorough about this is if you have an old food processor, an old one, um, a junker, put your sample in water, in there, I mean, screen the rocks out of it, <laughs> you know. And blend it, you know. Because it does seem to be a lot of this In other words, little tiny gravel or sand. Exactly. Or so that gets into it. Now here's the bottom line. Because all we really want to know is what, what, how much clay do we need for the clay straw building? Right. We need 50%. Have we done it with less than 50% clay content? Absolutely, we've done it with less. Simply the walls are denser. They're denser. And it works. If you want the walls lighter, you basically screen that clay. Once you have slip, yeah. you can um, you can spin it at high speeds with a high speed uh, slipomatic. Uh, yeah, they've made one of these. If you if you Google 